Hi, welcome to Dixie Storytime World. Little Mole Finds Hope, written by Glenis Nellist and illustrated by Sally Garland. If you want to buy a copy of this beautiful book, the link is available in the description at the bottom of this video. Little Mole was sad. He lay in his burrow deep underground and put his head in his paws. Little Mole, whatever's wrong? asked Mama. I, I just don't know, Mama, sniffed Little Mole, but I don't feel good inside. I'm sad. What you need is hope, Mama said. Hope? What's hope? Where do I find it? Little Mole asked. Come with me, Mama said, as she took hold of Little Mole's paw. Sometimes hope is hiding in the darkness. Sometimes it's hard to see, but it's always there. You just have to find it. Mama led her son gently out of the dark burrow, up toward the light. But on their way out of the tunnel, Mama stopped. Do you see this bulb, little mole? she asked. Mama pointed to a bulb squashed in the dark earth. It was brown, wrinkled and lifeless. It's dead, Mama, said little mole. No, my dear, Mama whispered softly. This bulb is not dead. Sometime soon it will feel the warmth of the sun. It will begin to grow and push its way out of the deep cold earth. One day, this bulb will become a beautiful yellow daffodil. Close your eyes, little mole. Can you see it dancing in the wind? Yes, Mama, cried little mole. I see it. I see it. That is hope, Mama said. Little mole and Mama reached the top of the burrow where the sun was shining. Look up, little mole. Mama said, what do you see? Little Mole looked up. He saw woodpeckers sitting in the trees. But the branches were bare. They stretched out like skeleton bones silhouetted against the sky. They're dead, Mama, said Little Mole. No, my dear, Mama whispered softly. The trees are not dead. One day soon, Buds will appear, and these branches will be covered in bright green leaves. Close your eyes, little mole. Can you see them dancing in the wind? Yes, Mama, cried little mole. I see them, I see them. That is hope, Mama said. Little mole and his Mama scurried along the edge of the woods until they came to Mr. Rabbit's garden. An old brown flower pot was lying on its side in the soil. Under the rim, something small and shriveled was hanging. It's dead, Mama, said Little Mole. No, my dear, Mama whispered softly. This chrysalis is not dead. One day soon, the butterfly growing inside will burst out of her shell. She will spread her wings and fly free among the flowers. Close your eyes, little mole, said Mama. Can you see her dancing in the wind? Yes, Mama, cried little mole. I see her, I see her. That is hope, Mama said. Little mole and his Mama went home. I had a wonderful day today, Mama, little mole said happily. Now I know that there's always hope, even in the darkest places. Mama smiled as she tucked Little Mole into bed, pulled his quilt up under his chin, and kissed him good night. And Little Mole closed his eyes and fell fast asleep, dreaming of yellow daffodils, green trees, and beautiful butterflies dancing together in the wind. The end. Thank you for listening, kids. And always remember that there is always hope. I'll see you soon in another adventure. Always remember to be good.
polite and kind.